Prime Minister Narendra Modi's statement immediately after the Hamas attack left no room for ambiguity. We are deeply shocked by the news of the terrorist attack in Israel. In solidarity, we stand by Israel in this difficult hour. The newspaper Indian Express concluded on October this is an unmistakable shift away from the carefully choreographed balancing act that characterized New Delhi's earlier responses to clashes between Israel and Palestine Tank Observer Research Foundation, which also advises the government, argues that today's geopolitics is characterized by the perception of self-interest. He speaks of limited liability partnerships among nations, India's differing behavior towards Ukraine and Israel, both of which were attacked in violation of international law, can be explained by this balancing policy, which some observers also call a seesaw policy. Unlikely unity India has long Russia became India's main supplier of armaments. To this day, the Indian armed forces depend on Russia's corporation for their arsenal of weapons. India also imports energy from Russia on favorable terms, despite having already reduced its dependence and actively seeking to diversify. India also abstained from the crucial vote in the General Assembly that overwhelmingly disapproved of Russia's war of aggression. Thereafter, Foreign Minister Subrahmanyam Ja India was the first non-Arab country to recognize the Palestine Liberation Organization as the only legitimate representation of the Palestinians. India, unlike Ukraine, has very close political and economic relations with Israel. But they were not always so friendly. When India won its independence from the British colonial power in 1947, this was enthusiastically welcomed by the Israelis. Yet, Mahatma Gandhi had previously been extremely critical of Israel's founding of the state in 1948. Palestine belongs to the Arabs. This distanced attitude towards Israel remained unchanged for a long time and India agreed to all on resolutions condemning Israel's Palestine policy up until 2015. India was the first non-Arab country to recognize the Palestine Liberation Organization PLO as the only legitimate representation of the Palestinians. It was only in 2015 that India abstained from voting for the first time alignment with Arab governments. A question of security India rejected Israel's advances for more than for decades. It is only since 1992 that Israel and India have had diplomatic relations. The Indian government's long hesitation was also due to the fact that India was dependent on oil supplies from the Middle East. In the meantime, the two countries maintain intensive relations in trade, with high annual growth rates in agriculture and in culture. Modernist vision of almost all categories of weapons. An agreement provides for the joint production of anti-aircraft missiles, according to estimates by the Stockholm Peace Research Institute CIPRI. The volume of Israeli arms exports to India in the last five years amounted to one dollar eight cents bean. To arm itself against the aggressive policies of China, India ordered more weapons from Israel. Indian Defense Minister Rajnath Singh and his Israeli counterpart Benny the War on Terror, after 11 September 2001, led to an intensification of India-Israel relations. Both countries had bitter experiences with terrorist attacks, Israel because of the unresolved Palestine issue, India earlier through the Tamil Tigers in Sri Lanka until today because of Kashmir over which India and Pakistan are bitterly fighting. In 2008, India experienced its 9-11, when a terrorist attack killed 160 delegation visited Israel, and, as a result, an Israeli trained commando unit was set up in Mumbai. With Israeli technical support, India created a central electronic monitoring system capable of extensively monitoring private communications. The notorious Israeli spy software Pegasus was also used in the process. The Israel-India relationship has progressed through their respective counterterrorism efforts and has remained untroubled since Modi's visit to Israel in 20.